Meredith, if you'd like to start, go right ahead. Hi, Aaron. Were you encouraged by Masahiro Tanaka's bullpen today? I was. It was, uh, he threw 30 pitches, um, threw all his pitches with r really good intensity. Um, so, yeah, I was really encouraged by what I saw today. Do you need to make sure that he comes back and has no issues tomorrow? Or in your mind, is the concussion part of it completely? Yeah, I mean, of course we've got to see him continue to respond to the different things we put him through. You know, again, whether it's the different cardio workouts, the different lower body workouts, now getting back on a mound and actually getting after it. Um, you know, how he responds to those things will be important. But so far, every step of the way, we've been encouraged by what we've, we we keep seeing. There were reports that DJ LeMayhew and Luis Sessa are expected back this week. Do you have a date for when they'll join camp? I don't. Um, you know, w when you see them in uniform, uh, then we'll be ready to, to talk about it. Who has the next question? Christy Ackert, go ahead. Hey, Aaron, uh, just curious, if you did get them back this week, what would be a time frame for them to be expected to be ready? Uh, I, I really don't know. Um, I mean, you'd have to make the evaluations of where they're at, you know, what exactly they've been doing, what they've been able to do, um, you know, and then have a plan of, of what they would need from a build-up standpoint. But I, I really, until we... Um, see them and see how they're responding and see how um, they're feeling and uh, and we make those evaluations, I, I wouldn't want to speculate. Also, Aaron Judge was out there again today. I assume he came through everything all right last night? Yeah, yeah, he did. And, you know, got a lot of at-bats in there again today. Um, but, yeah, everything looks good with Aaron. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Sweeney Murdy, go right ahead. Hey, uh, Aaron, both Aaron Judge and Luke Voigt have been talking about the extra work they've been doing on the velocity machines, the slider machines and all that, uh, and how helpful it's been. How has that technology changed since you played and maybe just uh, what it does to enhance their ability to see live pitching and get up to speed? I mean, yeah. I mean, the quality of that and the accuracy and – and, you know, even some of the things you can do now where you can, you know, replicate different spin rates on pitches and velocities to to the, you know, right down to the number is is uh, is definitely quite a bit more than uh, when I played, certainly. So, um, you know, they're, they're tools that we try to take advantage of and a number of our guys like to do those things. And, and, and in some cases, I think you know, speeds up the process, but certainly um, allows a guy to get some more game-like reps from a velocity, rotation, breaking ball standpoint than they otherwise would. Thanks, Aaron. Mm -hmm. Next question from George King. George? Yeah, Aaron, have you counted Panaka in or counted them out pitch through the first five games? Um... Not, not really either. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, yeah, I, I'd, I'd probably be a little surprised if, if it's the first rotation through. Um, and, and then it's just, again, seeing how his next bullpen goes, seeing how his facing live hitters go. And then, you know, what's, what's the best decision for us and for Massa as far as, do we want to build them up entirely at the big league level or do we want him to continue to build up and get to a point to where he's he's built up more like a starter? Those will be questions and, and conversations that we have internally and with Massa for that matter. Um, so we'll, we'll see where we are in the next few days, especially after he faces hitters for the first time. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Pete Caldera, the floor is yours. Aaron, uh, just uh, what's the plan for uh, Garrett Cole tomorrow? Do you, you push his pitch count, or you kind of keep him the same as he was? Uh, we'll probably keep him. Of... Yeah, we'll probably keep him similar. Um, I think he threw 85 last time, um, and we'll keep 84 maybe. 
anyway, we'll probably keep him around there uh, in that kind of same threshold. He pushed pretty hard last time on a on a pretty hot hot day, um, you know. So we'll probably keep him there, and then with obviously with the idea that he would go on his sixth day then um, for opening day. So it, it'll probably be similar to last time. Is there another question before we let Aaron go for the day? Christy, you're following up. Uh, hi, Aaron. You're seven days away from the season starting. Yeah. This is an unusual spring training or summer camp, whatever. Um, do you feel like your team is a week away from being ready? I, I'm encouraged. I really am, Christy. Um, you know, I, I think the biggest unknown for us, and, and even though we felt like we had a good handle on where guys were and what they were able to do while they were away, you still want to see it and see what it looks like. I've been really pleased with pretty much to a man. Our pitchers have come in. You know, you can tell they've been working and, and were somewhat built up. Um, I feel like our position players, by and large, came in in really good shape. So I do feel like we're in a good position. We'll push pretty hard these next um, four days starting tomorrow. You know, in my mind, I'm counting tomorrow like a game. You know, I know we have the three exhibition games, but tomorrow I think we've got eight innings to play. Um, so I'm looking at it as the, these next four games, um, pretty much all of our guys will play at least three of those games or play in three of those games and, and probably push them pretty far into the game. Um, and I feel like they're ready to do that. And, and that's, so that's been nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Sweeney Murdy. Aaron with, um, with Tanaka going again on Sunday and then having another uh, chance to have face hitters, batting practice, whatever, a couple of days after that. How is that factoring into what your roster decision is going to be? I guess you have to have that in Wednesday. Are you going to have enough information to make a decision on Tanaka? Uh, can he still be part of that if you don't maybe foresee him pitching for you until the following week? How does that work? Well, uh, you know, obviously the IL and stuff comes into play there, and we'll just see where we're at with him in, in his in his buildup. So, um Again, I, I mean, we'll we'll be in a good position. I feel like Wednesday to have a good idea about when possibly Massa could join us again. Whether that's three, five, six, ten days into the season, I feel like at that point we'll have a good idea of where he's at in his return. 